Hey guys, and welcome back to Mario. Let's continue, shall we? I believe we were on Big Bounce Byway. Seems about right, anyway. Let's go. I've gone back and I've got us two cat suits because that's going to make large portions of this <laughs> the world that we have left way, way easier. Anyway, let's go. This is a really, really fun course. As you can see by the name, Big Bounce. Yeah, we've got big bouncers everywhere, which is fun. Uh, what else have we got here? Anything good? Eh, nothing too great in there. Alright, well, let's take on these M&Ms. Or Smarties, whatever the hell they look like. And grab all this stuff. Now, most of this level revolves around needing to bounce around, as the name suggests. But hopefully, if we can hold on to this cat suit, we can eliminate most of the stress of that. Not all, but most of it. Ah, uh, this bit. Not sure if we can actually. We can actually kill these guys. That's going to make this a bit easier. I really want you to die, sir. Mr. Spiny. There we go. Excellent. Because if we hit this, we'll get some red coins to get. Now, I don't actually know what we get. Oh, we get a fire flower. And that is definitely not that useful in this level. Alright, well, whatever. Let's grab up everything. Keep going. Up the bungies. Oh, God. That's fine. Everything. Oh, yeah. We're a cat. We can just, like, climb. Ah. And luckily, you can climb through those platforms as well. So, much easier. Now, these guys. You can actually transform these guys or at least one of them, into a springboard. The only trouble is, eventually, he will turn back from a springboard into an annoying goit. But, we don't need to worry about that. Why? Because we have a cat suit. But if you bounce on him, that will reset his timer. I mean, basically, the general idea is to take him over here. But, you really oof, are complicating matters by doing it that way. Alright, let's make sure he's dead. As dead as a spring can be. Let's kill you. And you. And you for good measure. Make sure he's still dead. Oop. And come here, springy, bouncy mo Guyvin. And we need to get up here. We're bouncing on this thing. But, you know, we're a cat, so we don't really need to rely on that guy. We can just climb up much easier, much more efficient. Right, let's kill these smarties. Like, you can see why the cat suit is just OP. It really is. Like, no other power is required, <laughs> pretty much. Alright, and again, we can either, you know, make one of those into a bouncy, or we can, you know, run up the cage and do it that way. Because I like to believe we're smart. Smarter than the average uh, cat, anyway. Now, of course, this is where the firepower does kind of come in useful, but that's okay. As long as we're not super thick, we can just out around that. Ooh, remember what I said about not being super thick? Yeah. No guarantees. And there is our final Ooh, collectible. Got it. Oh, okay. <laughs> wow. That went so much better than I expected it to. Let's get rid of these guys. And of course... We can just use that, or we can do it the easy way, because we're a cat. And we like doing things the easy way. Really fun course, that one. To be fair, unlike most Mario games uh, at this stage, we haven't actually had a level that's genuinely not fun. And most Mario games generally have one or two levels that, ooh, God really make you uh, stress out. 
Ah. Oh. Right. Yes. This one. Yep, there's 10 stars here. This is Mystery House Mad Dash. You get a 10 second challenge 10 times. And it's sink or swim, baby. <laughs> These are quite fun. Stressful, but fun. I don't know if this fairy's going to tell us anything. Nope, not even if we butt bouncer. That's fine. 10 seconds to get to the star. It's a little challenge room each time. Let's see if we can do all 10 in one run. Hopefully we should be okay. They do get progressively more challenging, as you'd imagine. Oh shit, wrong way. <laughs> away from the bullet bill. Always away from the bullet bill. Oh god, these spinies. Ugh. I think they're called spinies anyway. Not 100% sure. Right. Oh no, they're not spinies, are they? Because the spinies are those tortoises with spines on them. Of course. I don't know what those guys are called. Okay. Okay. Four left. Should be okay. Three left. Oh god. Goombas. 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 Lots of Goombas. So many Goombas. That's fine. We don't mind Goombas. Well, that was easy. Oh, right, yes, this one. See you later, sucker. That was actually quite easy. I think you get another one of those later on that is uh, definitely not that easy. But I could have just, you know, got better at the game. <gasps> it does happen. But that was nice. A nice fat 10 stars. Happy with that. Anyway, onwards and upwards. Always onwards and upwards. Uh, yeah, Spike. So I guess... Ah, these guys are called Spike. Right. Not spiny. Got ya. Okay. I'm confused. There's so many characters in Mario, but that's cool. So much personality. Get out of here, dude. Not having none of your business. Oh, God. Where are you? Definitely don't want to tangle with these guys either. Now, if you're a cat, or if you want to go that way around, stamp straight away. Nice and easy. Ah, oh, another bell. Excellent. Okay. We could actually cheat this one. Kind of. And go up the side. <laughs> right, nice try, guys. Hey, where do you think you're going, sir? To your grave, obviously. It's the only place you're going, mate. Nice and easy here. Second start. As long as we don't make any silly mistakes. <laughs> Not as if I would make any silly mistakes. Okay, oh god. You know, like turning off the bloody switches that we've already turned on, for instance. Cool. Yink. Excellent. Yes, Mario. We are doing quite excellent, aren't we? So far. This is Mario. Anything can change in a moment. Ooh. Don't mind if I do. Ah, so close. So close, and yet so far. Now, there is uh, another wall that we need to climb up. But I don't think that's for a little while yet. Let's just get off these rolling Indiana Jones style spiky blocks of death. Because we don't want none of those in our buns, hun. Ooh. Okay, it's all good. It's all gravy. It's all gravy, baby. It's all gravy, baby. We worry about what are you worried for? I'm not worried. You shouldn't be worried either. <laughs> Oof. Almost cause for worry there. Almost. Oh, no matter. 
Red ring. Oof. This gives us a cat bell, I believe. Which would be quite nice. Yes, it does. Never have too many cat bells, apparently. So says I. The great cat whisperer. I'm going to kill all these spinies as well. Because they suck. And we don't like them. Because they're trying to throw spikes at us. And impale us. In the butt. Which isn't very nice. Oof. It's always sketchy jumping back down from here. Now this final star is right out in the open. Ah, son of a bitch. I knew that was going to happen. It was foretold. And so it was. Right, let's... No, I don't think we can take a shortcut up there, sadly. Oof. Ah, bollocks. Well, it's fine. It's fine. And I have a cat on my computer. And do you know why I don't like cats? If you guessed on my computer, you'd be right. Off. God, you're getting heavier and heavier to lift with one hand. Whew. Anywho. Hey, we got Spike. Now, there's some nice little secrets on this level that we can now access. So, we can go straight to the castle now, or we can go down here and get our first hidden area. We have a fire bro. Fire bro hideout. Go grab up all this stuff. Let's go kill the fire bros. Yep, as the uh, number there indicates, there's more than one of these. Right, so we've got three to kill. Ooh. Whoa, friendly fire isn't, dude. Friendly fire. That was savage. Well, if we could, <laughs> you know, collect that, that'd be nice. <laughs> I love all these little secrets hidden on the map. There isn't as many secrets in this game as I would have liked, but, you know, there's still plenty here. But I guess that's the thing. You always want more fun and cool little secrets. Now, this opens up. I think this is a toad house. Oh, no, it's not. It's not a toad house. Kind of gave it away, the fact that there was no mushroom there. But hey, who's, who's, who's looking for mushrooms, huh? Yeah? Right, let's go. We have a castle to crush. Now, I'd be a lot happier if we had a cat suit. So, I might actually go and grab us up a cat suit. Do we need a cat suit? Nah, I think we'll be alright. We'll probably find one here, to be honest, anyway. Um, ah, oh, actually. Yeah, we need 50 stars to get in here. There's, I, yeah, we actually do need a cat suit for them. There is a cat suit on this level, though. Alright, we'll find one. We shall procure our equipment on location, Metal Gear style. Seems like a reasonable thing to do. Lava rock layer. Let's do this. Let's go, Mario. Again, this is a nice, fun little castle level, this one. Now, the first. First star is right off the bat here. Nice and nice and easy to get the ball rolling. Excellent. excellent. That's right, Mario. Everything is excellent when you're playing Mario. Everything is happy. Everything is chill. At least to start off with. Right, this is a cat suit here, if memory serves. Come on. Ah, oh, you son of a bitch. Okay, that is... That is potentially a problem. Let's get rid of him. But we might find another one later on. 
If not, we'll always come back into the level. It ain't no problem. So. Next thing we need is through here. Yoink. Give him a bonk on the head. And him a bonk on the head. He can go over that. He can go that. Okay, cool. Ah. Uh, Oh, there is a cat suit coming up. Reason being, we need to climb up this wall here. Ah, we've got Goombas. Goombas afoot. Now, we also need to get this star. Well, that's easy enough to get. We can kill the enemies with their own... Oh, God. I say that. Ah, oh, shit. Come on. Oh, God. This ain't going well. This is not going well. Ooh. Cheers, Boulderbro. You're a good man, Boulderbro. Kill your brother. Thanks. Might just let you live for that. Might. Ooh. There we go. I don't think there's anything actually else is up here. All right. Well, whatever. We have accomplished everything we set out to accomplish. I thought there was something if we destroy all these. Nope. Sadly not. Sad face. And this leads us to the boss. He is a giant, massive boulder. And if you guess that we got to throw his children into him to kill him, you would be right. But there's no love lost because he's quite happy to kill his own children anyway. So I don't know whether we're doing him a favour. Probably doing him a favour. Now this one's definitely easier if you've got a cat suit. Everything's easier if you've got a cat suit. Just ask Catwoman. I'm sure she'll agree. Now we only have to hit him three times. Oh, God. That one was just about to wake up again. Really don't want them to wake up whilst you're holding them, because you're going to have a bad time. Ah, son of a... It's fine. Get wrecked. Get the fuck out of here. It's Mario time, damn it. Nice and easy, boss just to get the uh, appetite wetted. We're on 18 minutes. Hmm. I would like to get at least 20 minutes going. Oosh. And there's another fairy. Freed of her cage. Yep, not entirely convinced that Bowser has put them in these pots. To be honest, I could quite easily imagine Link's been going around stuffing them in jars. You know Link, you know he likes to stuff fairies and other creatures in small jars. It's just, it's in his nature, it's what he does, you know. No point getting angry at him about it. Anyway, now we have a proper way to get to World 5. And not just our cheesy, cheaty way. Now, I think that's everything here. It is. Oh, wait. Is there another? Is there another secret world here that we missed? No. No, that's World of Four. Yeah, hidden. Okay, cool. That's fine. Well, hmm. What should we do? Oh, should we just do Toad's levels? Let's do Toad's level. Come on, Toad. Captain Toad plays Peekaboo. Uh-oh. That doesn't sound good. 
We've got booze to deal with. I don't like dealing with booze. So hopefully... Oh. Look around. I've forgotten now. Ah, right, yeah, so... Got ya. This is obviously easier on the touchscreen. Because you can... Okay. Don't think so. I don't know. I'm not using the internet, babe. Right, let's go through here. Oh, that was obviously the wrong door. Ooh. Right. So. Okay. Unfortunately, we're being chased by a boo, which is not exactly ideal. Uh, can we put... Aha! Oh, I didn't know Toad could kill boos. Kind of interesting. Right. That works. Ah. That's kind of cool. Kind of clever. Right, I'm guessing we have to zap these guys. Kind of. That works. Oh god, we've got to go back through them now, haven't we? Although... Toad... is a murderous killer. Murderous killer. Of booze. Right. Not bad. That's another five. Another five in the back pocket. Anyway, guys, in the interest of saving time, I am going to leave it here. Thank you very much for watching. And when we come back, we're going to Sunshine Seaside. And I cannot wait. However, that's going to have to wait until I'm on holiday. Which is five days away. But still. Could be worse. Could be further away. Anyway, thanks for watching, guys.